Hi, I'm Nellie. So the facilitation that I propose is called Map Your Experience, and the intended audience is for Gemstone 100 students who are learning about the university. So this activity has two goals. The first goal is to make students aware of the different opportunities and organizations that might show up outside of the first look fair, such as opportunities that students might only really learn about after being on campus for a while. And the second goal of this activity is to help students map out how they might get involved with these different student organizations or programs and to help them visualize the steps they should take to reach them within their four years at the University of Maryland. So um, to introduce this activity, uh, SLs can talk to students about the different programs or student organizations that they have become involved with throughout their college career at Maryland. Um, SLs can explain whether or not they found it difficult to find these opportunities and explain how they got involved with whatever extracurricular cur curricular they have benefited from most at the University of Maryland. I know personally the organizations that I'm most involved with now I d wasn't aware of or wasn't really aware of the steps I needed to get involved with those organizations when I was a freshman at Maryland. I think students having the opportunity to really map out how they might get involved with organizations that they think are beneficial to their college experience will help them really just get that college experience that they have been visual envisioning but also help them become much more efficient and effective in reaching these goals. So in this activity um, students will map out their future goals as student leaders and look at the ways to plan ahead to facilitate meeting these goals. Some examples of the type of goals students can propose are leaderships in student government, a TA position in a, a STEM or science class, an SL position, a research position, leadership position in a student-run organization, in, internship opportunities, uh, involvement in programs such as federal and global fellows program, um, such as TAMID, study abroad, involvement in other external academic programs. Or student employment. Um, in addition to these goals, um, there are also, in addition to these academic and resume building experience, students can also propose involvement in student organizations such as club sports, Greek life, um, in organizations such as SEE or the co-op. Uh, SLs can assist in this part of the activity by providing examples of student leadership or involvement that entering students might not be aware of. Additionally, students can take time at this part of the activity to look through their major college websites where they might become aware of internship opportunities that they or other programs that they previously didn't know about. Additionally, students should look through OrgSync to see if there's something that pops up that they've never heard of before but matches their field of interest. So once students identify these organizations or programs that they are decided they want to meet within their four years. Um, we'll talk about planning and how to reach them. So similar to making a four-year plan, we'll talk about the different steps that students need to take in order to become involved with organizations, especially organizations um, that have application deadlines or other sort of deadlines. Um, so during this part of the activity, students can draw using maps made out of markers and um, paper the different milestones that they would need to reach in order to become involved um, and before meeting their long-term goals. So the goal of this activity is that students are able to visualize the steps they need to curate their desired college experience and also realize the effort they can put in right now in order to ensure that they meet these goals. So <clears throat> after the activity is finished, um, this activity can be assessed through uh, a few manners. Um, a verbal check-in with the SL or Connect Mentors would be a really good method to assess if students really got anything out of the experience. Additionally, I think a reflection following up on how students are planning uh, in the immediate future to start working towards these goals will also help students demonstrate what they got out of the um, activity. And finally, Students can set personal deadlines within the first semester or later, and later on during these dates, the SLs can meet with them and talk about why or why not they haven't reached these internal deadlines. I think overall, this activity will help students 
who maybe are overwhelmed by all the different opportunities on Maryland really focus on getting involved at least with one thing throughout the first semester, which I find usually helps students feel integrated in the college um, community and also have a really good and enriching first semester.